everybody, it's your boy MC from MCTV. Welcome back. I'm glad to be back. This weekend we got some fights coming up. Uh, let's see, uh, Ryan Garcia, Emmanuel Tego. Um, now, let me give you all a quick prediction. You know, I think Emmanuel, he's in his 30s, like 33. And Ryan Garcia is, what, like 26 or something like that. So, you know, there's a little age gap there. But I got Emmanuel Tego. I'm just betting on Emmanuel Tego simply off the strength that I don't really fuck with Ryan Garcia like that. I'm, I don't really like the clown. You know, I'm not with the shenanigans. You know what I'm saying? So, Emmanuel, he's only, what, he's damn near undefeated or only got, like, one loss or something like that. Go Emmanuel, man. You a beast, man. If your record is that clean and you that old, I'm betting on you, bro, all right? And then who else is fine? Gennady Golovkin. I ain't really too interested in him either, so let's skip past all that. That's what I got to say about uh, Garcia and them. Tank Davis versus Haney. Not really too interested in that. Right now, like Haney's been saying, He's got the epitome of what any boxer would want in front of him right now. That's become an undisputed. That's for all the marbles. There's, you should never look past that. In fact, this is the moment. This is it. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not even looking past Haney and Combosos. I feel like Haney deserves this moment. He shouldn't be looking past anything else. Everybody is going to expect a million different things out of him. But you know what? The only thing I expect out of him is to do what he's got to do to get all four of the marbles, okay? Because he's put in the work. You know what I'm saying? He's been ducked. He is the boogeyman. And when he gets all those belts, he can't possibly be a Teofimo or a Lomachenko or a Cambosos because he, he's the one. He's the chosen one. He's the dream. He couldn't. He can't have the curse. Those belts are the curse for anyone else but him. Those, those belts are his gift. He deserves them belts, if you get what I'm saying. So, I'm really looking forward to Undisputed. Devin Haney versus Combosos in Australia. You know, we've seen what Haney's been through. And y'all know what it is, you know. But Haney's the man. Haney's the one. Haney's the dream and the nightmare, okay? He'll give it to anybody, you know. All, I'm putting all my bets on Haney, man. You know, we got Dillian White, uh, Tyson Fury. I just hope Dillian White is really working on his stamina because I think stamina is going to be the key when you're facing against Fury. Obviously, we know Fury's cheating and all that. But as long as you come in with some good stamina, we know you got strength. You just need the stamina and you're doing good and working on resistance and, and knowing his tactics, how he likes to lean and do the chokes and the guillotine chokes and rabbit hits, all that good stuff. I don't know what it is. It's your boy MC from MCTV. I'll be back with y'all with another one soon.